Fauquier County deputies are investigating an unusual burglary attempt. This happened Sunday night at a convenience store in a very rural area around Catlett. Two teens from Washington, D.C. were caught and arrested. And as Northern Virginia Bureau Chief Julie Carey reports, police believe the teenagers rode bicycles from the D.C. all the way to Fauquier County. Dumfries Market sits alone at a very rural crossroad about 50 miles outside Washington, D.C. The front door now repaired, but this is what it looked like after deputies say two teenage boys began smashing it in Sunday evening, not long after closing. Carl McGrew is a regular here. That doesn't happen here. That's not part of our lifestyle. So what, what's going on? And found out it was kids. They did it. But as the teens pounded away, an employee was still inside cleaning up. He hit the silent alarm, running to hide near the back of the store. A 911 call was made, and deputies happened to be close by, the security camera capturing the arrest. On the footage, the police officer got the one at the door, and then they got the other one on the other side of the building. Tim Eckerd runs the store in the daytime, surprised to learn the would-be burglars were children just 15 and 16. Thank you. The age. You want a bag? Just young. Just look like kids out riding their bike on a summer, you know, summer evening, way too late, but. And those bikes, get this, they were from a D.C. bike rental company, Capital Bike Share. The deputies learned that they were actually out of Washington, D.C., and they had made their way out to Fauquier County on Capital Share bicycles. Early in the day, Virginia State Police received reports of someone biking on I-66. Customers at Dumfries Market not sure what to make of crime reaching their quiet country corner. Teens today are different than when we were coming up. There's no, doesn't seem to be much of a consequence to what they do, and I think that's why they do it. It's not right. The people are just getting rougher and less, more disrespect, more just don't care. The sheriff's office glad they got here before something was stolen or someone was hurt. We certainly, you know, are glad that our units were close and were able to prevent uh, further crime from happening. The teens arrested now facing multiple charges. In Fauquier County, I'm Julie Carey, News 4. The teenagers were being held at the Loudoun Juvenile Detention Facility. One of them had been reported missing from D.C. prior to his arrest.